double the FPS in three, two, one. There you go, from 45 to 90 FPS in DCS. Double the FPS again in three, two, one, and whoppa. From an unstable FPS to 90 FPS in Pulsar Lost Colony. And this is 90 FPS in DCS with a 1.5 render scaling in the Oculus settings. Holy moly. And you can easily achieve the same by using the VR Performance Toolkit. Games like DCS that are not made for VR run very well with this mod that can be used for almost any VR game. Both for the Steam VR as on the Oculus runtime and it is very easy to install. Click on the link in my comment down below and on that page, on the right, click on VR Performance Toolkit. Now below download the VR per kit v0.3.zip and extract it in a folder on your desktop. To use this mod, in for example Pearls Are Lost Colony, you copy the dxgi.dll file and the VR perf kit file to the game's main folder where the .exe file is. When you have done that, you can config the VR perf kit file to your liking. I got the best performance, setting it to the AMD Fidelity FX Super Resolution, so that is FSR, and using an upscale between 0.6 and 0.9. Now there are more settings that you can change, so do whatever you prefer. Don't forget to save it and just launch up the game and have fun. Now let me know in the comments down below if you have any questions, but especially let me know what boost it gave to your performance. And if you want to keep up to date with the latest PC VR updates, then subscribe to this channel. I hope to see you all in the next video. Ciao, ciao.